Hi loves! I feel like it's been so long since I properly sit down and filmed a video for you guys but um, we are currently in my bedroom because I actually moved my vanity into my bedroom so this will probably be the regular background for now <laughs> but um, today's video is going to be super exciting. My sister Kim actually gifted me this guy over here. It's the Installer Wet to Dry and um, Thank you so much, sister, if you're watching. That was very sweet of you. But um, my, I think I'm pretty sure both of my sisters use the InStyler um, to style their hair quite often, and they absolutely love it. And my sister just got one for her and one for myself as well. It's the InStyler Wet to Dry. And I've never used the InStyler before, nonetheless, um, the wet to dry version so I'm super excited to do to film this first impression for you guys and so of course you we'll can see how it goes. Installer wet to dry on wet hair but normally I would wash my hair at nighttime so to be completely honest with you guys I just dampened my hair with water and um, kind of like towel dried it so this is what it looks like right now it's a little bit damp and wet and Installer towel came dry in this cardboard uh, box it was very simple packaging and this is what the Installer looks like right there it's a beautiful white and silver color and a pink as well so it's super pretty it has uh, three different temperature so high medium and low you just press this button here and this is the barrel this is what the little combs look like. The bristles is actually quite stiff. And then there's a little barrel inside there as well. And then it also comes with a swivel cord, which is nice so you don't get everything all tangled and stuff. So it's very sleek looking and it's not very heavy as well. And this is what the cord it also looks came like right with this there. little travel case as well. It's just a black color and it says Installer at the bottom there. And this actually you can use it to place your Installer down as well so it doesn't ruin your countertops like that. And it has a little orange little ball there. And then also it comes with a and then it um, also comes user with manual this little uh, instruction thing as well. It says the top four things you must know about your Installer wet to dry. So it says number one, towel dry, and then number two, one to dry and one to style. Glide the Instyler slowly down your hair once to dry, and then once more to style it. And then number three, go slowly. The Instyler works best if you glide it through your hair slowly. Repeated passes should be unnecessary if you proceed slowly. And number four, listen to the crackle. If you hear a little crackling, that means the moisture is evaporating properly from the barrel High and not setting in your it's hair. ideal for thick, coarse hair, medium, uh, thin to medium textured hair. Low is ideal for thin, fine hair. I think I'm gonna use you medium. Can use today. this Instyler wet to dry to straighten soft curls. Flip it also under or flip a out. thermal guard that you actually put on the Instyler. So it looks like to avoid that having right the hot there. surface come in contact with your skin. To assist you, we have included the thermal guard training aid. So I'm going to be a rebel today and not use this and we'll see how it goes. And then finally, it also includes a little styling comb as well. And it's very well made and also has like a little oh, section. Let's go ahead and do this as well. I'm getting quite nervous because it's always a little bit nerve wracking trying a new hair tool. But we're going to go ahead and I grab the little and test like this out. So. And then position the barrel near my scalp, like it says, and push together. Wow, I definitely see steam coming off of my hair. <laughs> Go ahead and do that again. Because it says once to dry and then once to style. And it's feeling kind of the same. It doesn't feel like super dry at all. So we'll see. Hopefully I'm doing this right. You guys see that steam? Hmm. Gave me a little oh, bit of I would of normally style my hair from bottom to top. And I tried that piece on the top there and I found that you had to uh, sweep the installer about two to three times for or twice in order for it to get sort of dry and then the third or fourth time in order to style it. So one or two times they didn't cut it for me. So I'm gonna go ahead and just start styling the bottom layer here. But it's pretty cool that it dries your hair as well. And I think in order to use this, your hair has to be like really towel dried and not like soaking wet. Cause I don't find it to be like a blow dryer or anything like that. So your, your hair pretty much has to be like 
towel dried and quite dry. But it's fairly easy to use as well and basically all you do is just press it together and then this barrel starts rolling like so and then this kind of combs your hair and separates it as well so it's pretty cool very dry and it's also giving me a little bit of volume as well. Let me see if I can get more volume. Woo! Woo! Slipped out of my hand. Good thing I caught it, but I didn't catch it on the hot part. Thank goodness. Ooh. Very nice. Very nice. It's looking very smooth and silky as well. I like it. Let's go ahead and do the other side. Now that I finished straightening and styling my hair, I'm gonna go ahead and try one strand to curl my hair with the Instyler wet to dry and see how that goes. Let's see. Here, wrap I hair this. carefully <laughs> around the barrel from roots to end with the barrel side facing your scalp. Um, gently close the Instyler onto the hair section and rotate the wrist slightly to make sure the ends are included. Let the barrel rotate in place for five to 10 seconds, then let hair fall gently from the barrel. And then it says here, allow Instyler wet to dry to rotate in place a few seconds longer than normal when you're using it on damp hair. So my hair is dry right now. So I'm gonna just do it for five to 10 seconds. So let's try this, I'm kind of nervous. <laughs> so well, maybe that's too big of a section. Let's, let's do a smaller section. There you go. Okay, so we wrap it like so around the barrel. Be careful not to burn your fingers. I'm sure once I get the hang of this, it'll go faster, but this is all new to me, people. Okay, so I'm gonna close the barrel and twist my wrist slightly. I don't know if this is gonna turn out good. All right, and then just let it slide out. Oh, <laughs> that's not that bad, right? Not bad for my first try. That's a nice loose wave. Okay, let's go ahead and try another one because I know I can do better. <laughs> okay. Let's go ahead and try that again. I was kind of scared of burning my hands on the barrel, but you guys know I'm a rebel today, so go ahead and twist the hair around the barrel and then close the clamp. And then turn my wrist slightly. Five to ten seconds. And let it go. Oh, not bad, not bad. Those are pretty nice little waves or curls, soft curls. That's very pretty. It's very like romantic, don't you guys think? It's very easy to do as well. Definitely have to have more practice, but I really like it. I'm trying to beautiful. straighten out those two curls for a few minutes now and as you guys can see it's not completely straight so if you guys were to curl your hair with the Instyler I'm 1000% sure that it's gonna last so all day my final long. thoughts <laughs> on the Instyler wet to dry is I am completely in love with it. It was just such a pleasant hair tool to use. It's my first time trying it, like I mentioned, so it was just really nice to use and it was so easy to use as well. It's very straightforward. Um, the, the one thing I really liked about this is it wasn't too heavy, so my wrist and my arms weren't tired at all throughout the whole styling process as well. And um, it just made my hair look so silky and soft and smooth and it just feels really like light and bouncy like I just came out of the hair salon so I love that feeling and when I straighten my hair normally and I, I just like style and stuff it doesn't look 
like this. It just, this one just makes it so smooth, so soft, so silky looking, and it just adds more like bounce to my hair. So I absolutely love that. And um, another thing is, since this is the InStyler Wet to Dry, what I would recommend you guys, or what I noticed as well, is your hair has to be pretty much towel dried, um, almost close to dry in order for it to work or to style your hair. Um, on the little uh, pamphlet here, it says one to dry and one to style. So your hair definitely has to be like almost dry in order for that rule to work. But if your hair is a little bit more damp, you have to run it like probably three or four times in order for it to dry and also style as well because my top part of my hair was a lot uh, wetter and damper than my bottom part so that's what I noticed with the top and the bottom just that one to dry and one to style. Um, Another thing we'll I love about the InStyler wet to dry is kind of like a four in one tool because you can straighten with it, you can curl with it um, and also it's kind of like a blow dryer as well. So straight, curl, blow dry and also it has these little bristles there as well so it kind of combs your hair and smooths it out while you're straightening or curling your hair as well so four in one tool you know all in one so that's a really great thing and overall it just was an awesome tool and as you guys saw when I curled my hair it just gave the most beautiful soft romantic curls so I'm excited for next time to curl my hair with this because that was really easy I just have to get the hang of it and then you know I'm good to go, but those curls were absolutely gorgeous. And my sisters curl their hair with this all the time, and their curls are so beautiful. And their curls last. And my final all day final thoughts well. on the Instyler Wet to Dry is it is an awesome hair tool, and it's so quick and easy and simple to use. Like you guys saw, even though it was my first time and I was kind of fidgety with it, after a while I got the hang of it, and it was just so quick and easy to style my hair, to straighten my hair, and to curl my hair. And I could just totally picture myself throwing away my straightener and my curling iron and just using this one tool for the rest of my life. Like it's that good. I would recommend it to you guys because it's just, I don't know, it's just an awesome tool. And I can't believe my sister hasn't, actually, I think they introduced me to the installer a really long time ago, but I just wasn't willing to go out and buy a new hair tool because I already had a straightener and a curling iron. But now that I have this and I got it for free too, my sister Kim gave it to me, so thank you sister! <laughs> um, I am just in love with it and I think this is my new go-to hair tool. So if you guys are interested in it, I'll link it down below and you guys can check it out for yourselves as well. And if you guys already tried the original InStyler or if you tried this version, the wet to dry version, let me know in the comments section down below how you liked it as well. And I think that's pretty much it for my first impression on the InStyler wet to dry. I hope it was helpful to you guys. And if you guys have any other questions for me, leave it down in the comment section down below. And I'll try my best to answer you guys. I always love chatting with you guys in the comment section. And yeah, that's pretty much it. Thank you so much for watching. And thank you to my sister Kim again for gifting me this. And thank you to InStyler for creating such an awesome hair tool. <laughs> and yeah, that's pretty much it. I hope you guys have an amazing day and I'll catch you guys on my next video. Bye guys. Mwah. Love you. Bye.